George actor Lance Barber defends the young Sheldon finale's biggest mistake when tackling the aftermath of his character's death. Months after CBS canceled Young Sheldon, some of the Coopers have successfully returned to the small screen via Georgie and Mandy's first marriage. While the Big Bang Theory franchise has officially moved on from Sheldon's origin story, it continues to be a favorite topic among audiences, especially with the way the family comedy drama ended. The Young Sheldon finale was generally beloved, but some narrative issues could have been easily resolved, including how Missy's ending was handled. In an interview with Dexerto, Barber addressed the matter, justifying how the young Sheldon ending shortchanged the Cooper's only daughter. The George actor explains that leaving Missy without any support in the aftermath of George's death was by design, as it sets up her future. Barber also adds that Missy's story will continue in Georgie and Mandy's first marriage, which means that there's still an opportunity to address the matter. Read his full quote below. Why Missy took George's death the hardest in young Sheldon. Missy was closest to her dad. Despite Missy being the most exciting member of the Cooper family, young Sheldon continued to underutilize the character. Sheldon, understandably, was always at the center of its storytelling, particularly in its earlier years. When it expanded its storytelling by giving the rest of the clan their respective narratives, George and Mary's only daughter remained on the sidelines. This issue was even baked into her narrative, as Missy rebelled in Young Sheldon season 6 to get her parents' attention. One thing that was consistent in the Big Bang Theory and its prequel was Mary's contentious relationship with Sheldon's twin. This naturally paved the way for Missy to develop a special bond with her father. While Mary doted on Sheldon and essentially ignored her other kids, her only daughter formed a bond with George. Some of the most heartwarming moments in young Sheldon involved the father and daughter, so understandably, losing her dad was a big blow to Missy. She resorted to rebellion as a way of coping with her grief, and sadly, no one was there to help her throughout it. At the end of young Sheldon, her arc was unfinished. Our take on how young Sheldon left Missy's arc and what it means for her future. Missy returns in Georgie and Mandy's first marriage episode too. I have been outspoken about my criticism of how young Sheldon handled Missy's story, including her ending. The character was quite popular, and she had a lot of narrative potential in the old show. That said, I also understand Barber's defense of how her story was left in young Sheldon. Missy's Georgie in Mandy's first marriage episode 2's appearance certainly continues her rebellious arc. The character will have more appearances in the series, as her relationship with Georgie deepens. That said, I hope that they give her other arcs other than being just a dumb teenager. In the aftermath of young Sheldon's dramatic season finale, fans were left reeling over the direction the show seemed to take regarding George Cooper Sr.'s storyline. The tension surrounding George's character, particularly concerning his untimely death as originally depicted in The Big Bang Theory, has been a topic of interest since the show's beginning. The latest season finale added fuel to this fire, and the reaction was intense. But actor Lance Barber, who plays George Sr., has recently come forward to address fans' concerns, defending the creative choices and shedding light on what some might call the show's biggest mistake. Embracing the Unexpected George has always been a complex character, Barber began, leaning back thoughtfully in his chair. And as much as fans know him as a flawed man, a husband struggling with his responsibilities, we wanted to make sure his end wasn't just an afterthought or a dramatic tool. There was purpose in it, every bit of it was intentional, Bang Theory asterisk fans have clung to the narrative shared by an adult Sheldon Cooper, who frequently mentioned his father's shortcomings. According to Sheldon, George Sr. was an unfaithful husband and a struggling father who eventually passed away when Sheldon was just 14. This bleak portrayal painted a grim image that young Sheldon's writers have delicately balanced with moments of warmth and redemption for George Sr. But the young Sheldon finale presented George in a new light, deviating from Sheldon's harsh descriptions. In his final scenes, he wasn't a man of vice but one who had, through a blend of vulnerability and strong understanding of his family and his role. The Intention Behind the Departure Barber explained that the series writers wanted George's final season to be a love letter to the complexities of fatherhood, adding dimensions to George's character that the Big Bang Theory fans hadn't seen before. 
There was so much more to him, Barber said. To leave it as simply he was unfaithful and flawed doesn't capture the man I've had the honor of playing for these past years. When asked why the writers didn't simply stick to the narrative established in the Big Bang Theory, Barber shrugged. It wouldn't have been honest. We're not just telling Sheldon's story, we're telling George's story, Mary's story, Georgie's story, and Missy's. George Sr. is a father, a husband, a man of his time, and, yes, a man with flaws. But he's also a man with moments of grace and humanity. And we wanted to showcase that. Lance Barber's personal connection to George. As Barber continued, his tone softened, reflecting his personal connection to the character he has portrayed for years. George Sr. resonates with me deeply, Barber admitted. Playing him has given me the chance to explore fatherhood, the struggles of balancing family expectations, and the pressure society puts on men in general. He's been more than a character for me, he's been a journey. Barber pointed out that George's arc in the final season was about giving viewers a chance to see George's inner life, one filled with regret but also with moments of profound love. We knew we couldn't rewrite the past entirely. George would still die, and there would still be pain. But we wanted people to walk away feeling like they'd gotten to know him beyond his mistakes. Responding to the fan outcry when the finale aired, fans quickly took to social media, some expressing anger, others confusion, and a few even felt betrayed by the changes. But for Barber, these strong emotions were proof that the writer's choice had worked. If people didn't care, they wouldn't be upset. And that's a good thing. The reaction showed that George meant something to them, he said, smiling softly. Some fans saw the finale as a mistake but I view it as an invitation for discussion, Barber said. The portrayal of George in Young Sheldon versus the Big Bang Theory doesn't have to be consistent because memory isn't perfect. Sheldon was a child when he lost his father, and maybe what we saw in Young Sheldon was the real George, not the filtered, simplified version Sheldon remembers. Building on George's legacy Despite the show's conclusion, Barber believes George Sr.